Hey you guys, it's Ava. Welcome back to my channel. You are looking at the cutest photo ever of my two-year-old son, Jacob. And you're about to watch a montage of photos and videos of his six-month lock journey. So as you can see, he has the finest hair <laughs> you've ever seen. It's super fine, silky, curly. And it is pretty much the same texture as his sister, Aubrey, pictured right here but completely opposite from his big brother Josiah who is pictured right here and um yeah the gene pool just did whatever it felt like doing with my children's hair textures but um on September 1st we decided since he has so much hair on his head let's go ahead and start him some locks so we started his locks with some box braids It legit took me like two days, like three, four different times to really do his hair because he would not sit still. Um, but he's come a long way. I can actually do his whole head in one sitting now. But um, at that time, I could not. His hair surprised me. I did not think it was that long, but we all know shrinkage is real, okay? Look at Yana girl and Jacob, born literally a month apart. Anyway, his new growth um started to kick in and his sides really were not locking so um right here i am putting some flaxseed on his hair to kind of like slick it down because um yeah it was just it was just doing whatever it wanted to do at this point it was his hair is super impressionable so it just goes whatever direction it wants to like if he lays on his head It'll just go the direction that he laid on it. Um, so yeah, that's what you see me doing right here. And as you can see, his sides are his struggle area. They just kept unraveling. And to this day, his sides are not completely locked. But look at my baby. You can see the new growth. You can see the, the frizz and all of that good stuff. Um... Right here, I believe, was right before his first retwist in October. And as you can see, um, I retwisted it. I used clips to pin it. I only used water and oil. You can see some of the braid pattern trying to go away. And um, that retwist honestly truly did not last long. I mean, I didn't put any heat to his hair. And I don't even think the clips were in there long because he was pulling them out. And I just was like, whatever. So we're, we're nearing the end of uh, month two, and this was his second retwist, so the month of November. And as you can see, it came out so good. My little prince is so handsome. At this point was when I realized like, wow, his hair is actually locking. Like I don't see the, the braid pattern really too much anymore, and like his lock journey is flourishing, so. Um, that's what was going on in the month of November. They started to um, lose length and thicken up more so, as they are supposed to do. So, of course, you know, as the month goes on, the hair starts to look crazy, but his parts were staying in place. They have always stayed in place, and they just did really good. So, as you can see in this picture, um, reaches number three, that... He started to bud. Um, once again, his hair just was like really locking. There were no braid patterns really to be found. He also got a nice trim. So that's why his hair looks super, super healthy right here. And also took a little bit of his length off. Okay, so here we are in the month of January now. And as always, his retwist comes out so good. It, it takes him from zero to 100 real quick, <laughs> like real quick. Um, not only is it starting to thicken up, but he's trying to get a little bit more of his length back. And um, 
he has legit locks. Here we are on the retwist in the month of February where he became six months locked. Look at my guy. <laughs> Oh, Jacob, he has grown so much in these past six months, obviously in height and weight and his personality. Children his age honestly age really quickly, if you know what I mean. Um, just reaching different milestones all the time. And I'm just grateful that his lock journey just adds to everything that he's achieving. There was a lot of skepticism involved in um, whether or not Jacob's hair would lock, for myself included. I mean, he wasn't even two years old when we decided to um, lock his hair. So he technically still had baby hair. And we just didn't know like what was to come, if it would actually lock or, you know, just whatever the case was. And I'm so excited for him and happy that his hair actually did what we expected or hoped that it would do rather. And um, my handsome young king, I am so, so, so happy with his journey and cannot wait to see how he um, transforms six months from now. So, yeah, thank you all for watching. And with that, I say shalom.